So today we are building a chicken coop and then we're hoping to get a chicken. Um, so we'll see how today goes. Two kids trying to get their work done. We started this morning at goodness, 6 30, I think. We had a bit of a late start for me, but the kids got up and got going. And these two in here are trying to suss out the chicken coop. How's it going? Uh, we're so nice. We thought about just having um, a chicken coop that just sits on the grass. So, like a chicken tractor slash so it'll chicken coop. a bit of a tractor kind of concept. It might be a bit lighter if we lose less wood. So. Lighter and cheaper. I'm liking it already. So, what do you have there, Andrew? Today, this is a Ryobi circular saw purchased in Australia to replace one of the 19 power tools that were destroyed in Hurricane Harvey in Texas. So, uh, my first Aussie power tool that I've purchased. So, when we're making a chook pen, we need at least pen. some tool. Finn, what did you get from Bunnings? Show me. A hammer stamp. Out of market. Look at this. Sure, Here's do you want me to put mark. your pencil in again? Wood. This is a very important tool. The most important carpenter's tool is in your hand. Do you want me to help you? Where you go like that and like that. That's your V. See the V? And at that point, the point of the V is your 12 inch is where you want to cut. So that's very fuzzy, but if you want Great. to Great. So sometimes a fast back and forth movement can you smell that, Phineas? What do you smell with your nose? I don't mind if you mess up. This is just the learning. Cereal. You smell cereal. What was yeah, that, Phineas? See if you, you can go back and. What do you smell? Cereal. Some strange cereal. Yeah, yeah hold it, Ben. Good job. Go. Hey, Esther. No, I Way to use your bum. <laughs> what? Way to use your bum. Yeah. It vibrates. <laughs> it's a massage. <laughs> All right. Really there. Going. Hold on tight, Ben. Keep going. Yay. Oh, you did it. All the end. All right. Well done. Are you tired? Getting turn. This. Kids are working hard to build the chicken coop. The new saw worked well. Did it work well, Daddy? Yeah. Oh. I had twice. I wanted to barely could get out. Then, so I had to do. I did it here. I think it would be strong enough. What are you building? A chicken nesting area. Nesting box. And you? How are you doing, Apollos? Yes, I'm done. Can I see yours? Dad, this is a piece you gave me. Wow, that looks awesome. My name's at the back. Dad, wait, wait. Carpenter and Andrew. I noticed that only you are wearing baby goggles. <laughs> I'm noticing that all of your children's eyes are fully exposed to shards of wood. I gotta protect my eyes so they can keep looking at you. Oh. <laughs> So how long has it been since you've put something together, like done carpentry? Well, I guess technically <laughs> yesterday since we made it. No, but I mean you, because the kids are doing that. Real carpentry, maybe about five, six years. Wow. You think about it? Yeah. Three years in Australia, Indonesia, four. I didn't do much in Galveston. Does it feel good to be back in the old carpentry saddle again? Yeah. Good skills never leave you, like riding the bike, as they say. But I bet you're missing all your tools that got washed yeah, away in my Hurricane one. Harvey. Heavy two power tools, power drill, and my power saw, which is gonna be my everything. So Utility it's, saw? It's my miter saw, it's my table saw, it's circular saw, it's everything.
So we're here at the feed store, collecting all the feed that we need for the chickens and for the other thing which I have decided that we're gonna get, Andrew's on board with, I think. So we've got our hay and our containment cage, bedding we're gonna use, and new feeders. So it's been a big shopping spree. So a surprise addition to this homesteading plan is we had success, not just one, but we got two blue-eyed, beautiful bunnies. So we have two females. We're gonna let them grow and get to about six months old, and then we're gonna contact our bunny man, as we call him, bunny man. and he's gonna get me a New Zealand buck. We're gonna breed a mixed breed for meat. But first, we're just gonna get to know these rabbits and learn they how to take to care of them and be like good mommies and daddies. And then we'll start eating rabbits, so stew, and grilled rabbits. So Esther's mm -hmm. getting the poopy box. Can you? No, 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 that's a poopy box. No, Esther, no. scoot it to the middle. No. No, there aren't. Mm. I did it. Can you put the poopy box in the middle so Phoebe can't reach it? There. Oh, the little bunny's having a drink. It's perfect because Phoebe can put her hands through and pat the bunnies. Can't she? Phoebe, you want to give her a pat? He doesn't like me too. Oh, no, no, don't climb up, love. Let's, let's just leave them up. Hi, mommy. That's a great idea. Let's close them up and give them a bit of a break. So we put them in a dog cage to start. Would you mind opening that door so the breeze can come through, boys? We put them in the garage in a huge dog cage. Now, because they're two does, females, and they're quite young, They'll be fine just like this for a little while while Andrew finishes off the chicken coop and then makes a um, some bunny. I, yeah, I guess you could call it a bunny coop. I think there's a name for it, but I can't a remember bunny it. Because whenever you try and ask me a name for something, I always forget it that moment. Um, Andrew is still bunny. finishing the chicken coop, uh, but we. Look at that carpenter at work. Such skill and talent and handsomeness all wrapped up in one package. Okay, so now we have, there's our two chooky chooks. Andrew and Gaius secured the pen, looked for all the little holes, and now the chicks are gonna go see if they were correct. <laughs> see if you missed any. Just wanna start with two little ones. One is a light Sussex and the other is an Australor. And right now they're gonna live in the dog kennel. This is just really for today, maybe. Andrew might finish today anyways. So we're nearly there. So we've got our two does. And in three months time, we'll add a buck. And then we have our two chick chookies. And we're not really sure yet what we're gonna do with chickens. But we're gonna start with two and start small and go from there. Man, she's a little carpenter, isn't she? On the other side, feel the edge. She doesn't like drawing. Alright, there. Lines are matched up. And Phoebe is in love with our bunnies. I'm actually a little concerned she's gonna knock it off of this table we have it on. Hey Phoebe, what do you think of the bunnies? Okay, so here is the finished rough form. We're gonna paint it, and Esther and I are gonna do some pretty stuff on it just for fun. Um, so this is, it's kind of in between a chicken coop and a chicken tractor, because we can completely enclose the birds from predators, if it turns out there's predators around here, which there may be, I'm not sure. And we've got two little nesting boxes in there. Excuse me. Of course they have, they're chickens. 
it's not a good angle. Don't there fit, we go. Don't, Esther, don't fit all the way. They've got the some food and water. And they're ready to grow, grow, grow. And then, and then we eat, also eat, have eat. this chicken run and we have a dog kennel, which works surprisingly well if there's no foxes because it protects them from overhead prey. And they were super happy just in there. Who won that? You're crunching on the video. <laughs> You're crunching. So it's seven o'clock at night and the kids haven't had dinner so we brought out the garage chips. The chips that are hidden in the garage for emergency situations such as this. Well, Dad, what do you think? I like it. It's a simple, simple production. And Esther Ash, was my main assistant. She was. She did really well. The, there is a flaw in, with this play. whole system, and it's right here. It's, it's a big security risk. It's the biggest security risk of all. Baby, baby, baby. <laughs> it is not baby proof. And they, the, the babies just come and open it immediately. Boop, open. Bye bye, chickens. Peace.